Welcome to Combative Wing Chun. I'm Sifu David. Today we're going to show you basic Wing Chun arm conditioning technique that everybody should know. Let's get into three ways of conditioning your arms for beginners. Here we go. And yes, we are giving away these free DVDs, Accelerated Wing Chun System Quick Start DVD. Normally retailing for 129 bucks, but enter the contest. All you need to do is to subscribe, click the notification bell, and like and comment on this video, and you'll enter automatically into the draw. Every week, we're gonna give away a free video. So, good luck. So if you want to develop arms like steel cables, like steel rods, then this is how you do it. So we're gonna start easy. We're not gonna start bashing our arms against wooden trees and things like that. Let's start easy. So the first easy exercise is start to rub your arms together like this. So from the side, I'm gonna do our chain punch motion, but I'm gonna do it by rubbing my forearms together. What does this do? Well, it desensitizes your forearm bones so that they are less sensitive to pain. In the same way that they roll the shins in Muay Thai, we are rolling our forearms together. Just like you're fouling two swords to become sharper, you're sharpening two forearms to become stronger. Okay, so make contact and slide it along each other, similar to kind of like our tooth cell technique. And tooth cell is in the first form, Wing Chun, near the end, the tooth cell, but we want to do it here. Slide it, feel the sliding on the skin, and feel the pressure on the bones. Okay, so that's the first technique, is to condition your bones. And you know what else happens, is your bone density starts to increase and you get thicker and stronger bones and more resilient. Okay, so just sliding your hands together. Another technique that you can do is start twisting them while you're sliding, just like in the tooth cell. So you start having a spiral motion to it. So from the if you look from the top, it'll look like this. So you twist, 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 or you twist, twist, twist here. Okay, so that's very basic. You can do that anytime, you don't need any equipment, and you can start learning this and conditioning your arms. Here's a basic Wing Chun arm conditioning exercise you can do. It's similar to the first one, but it's a little bit more advanced. So now, instead of sliding slowly, we're going to punch onto our palms and slide the bottom of our, sh of our uh, forearms on it. So we're gonna punch over top, slide, slide. Like that. Okay, so this side, I am punching and sliding and hitting on my own hand. So it actually will strengthen your hand and also strengthen your shin bones, I mean your arm bones. Okay, feel the sliding and also make impact. Once again, this is an exercise you can do anytime, anywhere, and you don't even need any equipment. So these are basic exercises because I don't want you to be bashing your arms against wood and metal just yet, because it will bruise your arms. You had a student that could not train anymore and because there was too much damage to his arms. Okay, so I don't want you to do that. So just to start simple, we're just gonna use our hands. And this is actually very effective conditioning your arms and your bones. Okay, so notice that there's a, there's a pop sound, you want that. So pop and slide, pop and slide, pop, slide, put into one motion. Pop, slide, pop, slide, pop, slide, pop, slide. Okay, so that is the second arm conditioning technique. Anyone can do this and we'll come back, we'll show you the third one. Okay, welcome back. Now we're gonna show you how to do a arm conditioning exercise on any piece of wood or metal 
So you don't even need a dummy. You can do this on a telephone pole. You can do this on a any kind of metal pole. You can do this on a tree even if the surface is not too rough. Okay, so this is what you do. So we're doing the ching punch. Now I'm going to punch and then use my forearm that way. Okay. So I want to get used to hitting and also sliding. Hitting and then extending and sliding. But your own pace don't get too hard. So when I'm hitting, I'm not hitting straight on. I'm hitting, start making contact with my forearm, and then extending that forearm forward. Down. And then sliding. So I hit here, and then extend forward and slide. Slide. Okay, you can do a low too. So that is the drill. So go at an easy pace. You don't want to uh, bruise your arms too much. So like I said, you can use a, any kind of um, uh, wood. Like for example, why do you bring in one of those poles there? Okay, so you can do it on any pole. It doesn't have to be a dummy. I'm just simulating this is, let's say this is a uh, light telephone pole. Or it could be a fence pole. Okay, so you can do that on a fence pole, same thing. And if you did the last drill that we did, you can actually do it with the same um, same footwork. So one, two, you can switch footwork. Three, switch footwork. Four, switch footwork. Two, switch footwork. So you can do it with the footwork. Do that again. So like the last drill we did, you can actually do this with footwork. So go one, two, three, switch footwork. One. Two, three, switch footwork. One, two, three, switch footwork. One, two, three, one. Okay, so that is the drill. You can do it on any pole. You can do it with footwork, and you can do it without footwork. Okay, so those are three drills, and then let me show you a bonus one. If you have a partner, they can do this with in the next lesson. All right, so if you have a partner, you can do a very similar drill with a partner. So we're gonna go punch, 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 and see how the arm's sliding. So this is exactly the same drill we did with the pole, but now you have a real person to train with, and now two people can benefit from this drill at the same time. Okay. Okay, so that is the arm conditioning exercise in Wing Chun that we can do with a partner. Okay, so that's it. Very simple. Those are three basic Wing Chun arm conditioning exercises that you can do at home without a partner or with a partner. Awesome, so those are three basic Wing Chun arm conditioning exercises that you can do at home. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, click like and subscribe. Click the bell button next to the subscribe button so you get all the instant notifications of all the new lessons coming out almost on a daily basis. So make sure that you also entered our DVD contest. The DVD contest is where you get to uh, enter every week to win my Accelerated Wing Chun Quick Start DVD, $129 value. Every week we announce a new winner, so good luck and we'll see you soon in the next video.